easy for yourself. See how I just got the hook right there? Just reach right around the other side. Keeps you from burning yourself. Okay, now pull the flame off of it. Got a little hot. Okay, now back to the uh, dielectric union. This is the uh, brass part of the dielectric union, which the uh, copper pipe will go into, and we'll uh, fuse the two together with the uh, solder. And just like any other fitting, we clean the brass fitting we, with the wire brush and clean the tip of it. And of course, flux it. Flux the pipe. And this small piece is what you might call a random piece, just a piece that you grab and just about the size that you feel that you might need. Okay, now you see that I'm putting the uh, union together, but I'm not putting the uh, plastic insert in there because I don't want it to melt. But once we solder this to the uh, brass adapter, we will take it back apart and then we'll put the plastic insert back in there. This is the reason uh, I do it this way, so that we don't burn the uh, plastic insert or melt it. And this way you can see how much easier it is to uh, solder a di dielectric union. Because now you have it braced on something where you can get to it easily. And what I usually do is when I do put the flame to it, I try to keep the flame going up. Because we, 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 we want to try to keep the uh, flame from coming down too far on the uh, nipple where the threads are so we don't uh, melt all the... Uh, pipe dope out of it and it'll keep out a nice tight seal okay there we go we just wipe it off of there and remember all the flux was wiped off from the outside to keep the uh, solder from going everywhere and that's what keeps us from having a messy solder joint <laughs> 